introduce you to my new boat, uh, 1971 Boston Whaler. 45 years old this year. It is just 13 and a half feet long. It's got this 1996 uh, Tahatsu um, 40 horsepower, two-stroke oil injected. Now Tahatsu, what I've learned, makes the motors for Mercury and for Nissan, apparently. It does have uh, power tilt trim. Love this, there's a 12-gallon gas tank that's under the middle, uh, or sort of in the front, or I guess mid-front of the boat. Keep the weight even. It's got a uh, bilge pump installed back here. It's got the Tuhatsu uh, tack and the trim guide, which works. Which is awesome. The mahogany in here is in excellent shape. As you can see, it's also, I suspect, all sort of custom done, at least this part here. I haven't seen one like that before. The hull and the rub rail are in great shape. The trailer's in pretty good shape. I got all these wheels, uh, rollers aligned under here and made some adjustments. This thing rides really well and it pulls really easy behind my uh, my little Subaru. Hardly tell it's there. I don't know if this was uh, typical Mercury Tahatsu connectors or this was the guy. I suspect this was the guy that owned it before. It has these great quick release connectors on here. Um, there's also another gas tank that came with it. In addition to the tank under the uh, seat the, that came with this gas tank. And you can see both of them had this problem that you can't read what's going on there. I just had uh, a, a leftover in my shed. A, um, this is one of those headlight restore kits. Comes with a plastic polish and let's polish this up and see how it does. Pull that on there. We'll just hit it with this. Well, there you go. If not good as new, at least it's, it's good enough. It's not perfect. Uh, you can see the people that had it before me, I think, had some problems. So they broke off a good chunk. Let's see, the sun is coming in here at this bad angle. Let's see, a good chunk of the cavitation plate. And down here that's as well. As it's winter, I've just replaced the uh, lower unit oil. Uh, I was reading the instructions in the the manual or whatever and it's supposed to, you're supposed to replace the impeller and the water pump at least once a year. I suspect it hasn't been replaced for I don't know 10 years maybe <laughs> on this one so I'm gonna try to figure that one out. I ordered a kit and I'll make a video of that although I'm sure there's plenty other videos. It's running. Oh, wait a minute. I'm going to go focus. Alrighty. Can you clip your well, things a little better? Yeah, I can. All right, let's go for it, huh? Alrighty. Neutral. All 
All right, now we're getting out the GPS to um, show how fast we're gonna go. So yeah. Now we're at 32. 